Coming at you with a thrifted, vinted, vintage haul for my nephew who is turning two this weekend. I cannot believe that Oakley Bear is turning two and to mark the occasion, what does auntie do? She goes on vinted and to charity shops and finds him the best clothes possible because that is my love language. <laughs> So anyway, I'm now realising that I basically just bought him navy. Um, that is completely coincidental, but I'm going to show you what I got. Um, so this little coat is actually Arquette. I cannot with it. It is so cute. This is up to age three, so this might be a tiny bit big for him. But also, he's a big boy. He's a big two-year-old. He genuinely looks like a four-year-old, so I think we're okay. Um, but no, such a cute little Sherpa coat. I am obsessed Okay, and then this is definitely for when he's a bit bigger. His dad is going to cry over this. He is going to absolutely love it. We are from the countryside. We are from tractor land, whatever. However you want to describe the countryside. And I just know that his dad is going to love this little gilet that I got him with the tractors on it. So freaking cute. I honestly don't know how I found this, but I did. And yeah, 10 out of 10. Then just like a little basic little Nike hoodie. I thought this would be good for him for when he's going to nursery. Again, this is age three, but I feel like the oversized fit will be really sweet. Then I definitely went to town on the Ralph Lauren pieces. I'm sorry. My boyfriend actually used to have this top, which is so funny. Um, and now I've got one for Oakley. It's just the teddy bear Ralph Lauren top and it is a 12 out of 10 and it's so cute. I know his mum is going to absolutely die over it. Then other Ralph Lauren bits I've got is this tiny little navy vest. Have you ever seen anything so freaking cute? I'm obsessed with it. Then this is like a literal 12 out of 10. I cannot. Um, this is two years old, so I'm hoping this will fit him absolutely fine. Um, and it's just a little Ralph Lauren zip up jacket and then these are kind of what age are these these are three so that's fine these are little navy ralph lauren shorts i thought for holidays next year they'd be good um and then this is potentially one of the best pieces that i got it's the ralph lauren flag jumper and now i'm telling you that i literally paid like maximum i think the most expensive item i got was like 15 pounds otherwise they were all far more reasonable and just I, I can picture him in it and he's going to look incredible and I can't wait. Um, then I didn't realise how paint splatty this would be. I also ordered him a red gap cardigan, like zip up like this, but it hasn't arrived. It's got lost in the post. Not sure about the paint splats. I know his mother isn't going to be sure about the paint splats either, but I thought he can wear it for nursery anyway because Anya just puts him in like clothes he can kind of get like messy and everything like that. Um, then I also got him this little North Face beanie. How freaking cute. I'm obsessed. And then I also got him quite a few pairs of shoes. I'm not sure where the other foot is, but I got him these Ugg boots. I'm sorry. They are just so stinking cute. He's not like such a smart little boy. Um, then I also got these, which were probably my worst choice, but I didn't quite realise how like flat and felty they were going to be. But they are very, very cute potentially one of my best purchases the mini timberland boots obviously they're like a bit wrecked at the front i was gonna try my suede brush on them but also he is two years old he will put them on and wreck them anyway so why would i pay full price for them when he is going to wreck them cutest little timberland boots and then finally a pair of jordans i know his father is going to appreciate these a lot um so yeah those are all the treats that i got my nephew for his second birthday and if you have kids or you have nephews or nieces my biggest recommendation is to buy them secondhand clothes because they grow out of it so quickly and they ruin it so yeah that's my two pence